This is just a short video that we've put together uh, to support you with using Accelerated Reader at home with your child. If your child is in Year 7 or in Year 8, and for some students in Year 9, they will use Accelerated Reader as part of their English curriculum. So Accelerated Reader is uh, essentially a computer programme that helps your child's teacher to manage and monitor their independent pre reading practice. So they can choose a book that's at their own independent reading level, they can read at their own pace, and then when they finish that, they can take a short quiz on the computer, and that will check their understanding um, and allow them to make progress towards certificates and rewards. Why we do this in school is to support your child with developing their reading gauge, their reading uh, comprehension, and also their enjoyment and love of reading to make sure that they're able to access the wider school curriculum um, and to therefore become a really successful student with us here at Royds Hall. There's lots of things we do at Royds um, to support your child with reading, and this is one that they are accessing um, every week. So I've put together a, an accelerated reader guide. This is on the website um, as a guide for students, but I wanted to give a, a parents a bit of an opportunity to see this so that it makes sense to you at home. So step one is to go onto the Accelerated Read Reader website. It's really important that this link is followed because um, it's a specific one for our school. They must go onto it using that um that link there they will then be taken to this screen and they will need to log in you with their username and password it's usually um their first initial and then their surname or it would be their first initial and the first four letters of their surname so it'll be one of the two uh, for logging in, your child will have this in their planner and the password for everybody using Accelerated Reader is ABC. So it's the same for everybody accessing Accelerated Reader. When they've logged onto the programme, then they'll see this screen here. Um, and it's the orange one that we want to go on to. We're not taking the Star Reader test. That's something we do in, in school um, termly. That's not something to be done at home. But this um, orange button here, Accelerated Reader, is the one for them. They should be taking these quizzes within 48 hours of finishing the book. So encouraging your child to be taking these at home um, to do the very best that they can in them is really important. Any longer than that, and they do start to forget parts of the book um, and don't tend to do as well on those quizzes. So once they're onto the orange logo, they'll go onto this screen here where they can search for the book or they can type in the quiz number, which is from the inside of the library book cover. And then that will take them to the books themselves. So if you see, for example, here, I've searched for Alice in Wonderland. Um, that's given me lots of different options. Um, so I have to make sure that I am choosing the correct version of that story. And then I will click to take the quiz and I will complete that and hopefully the students will do that to the best of their ability. They will be asked to choose how they've read the book. So they can read if they've read with somebody else. So if you've helped them read that at home, if they've read it by themselves, or if they were read to. The likelihood is for most of our students is that they will have been reading by themselves independently, or they may have read with somebody else at home. So if they select the statement which is most true, and then they complete the quiz. There's usually um, between five and 20 questions, depending on the length of the book. Um, and they need to make sure that they concentrate on this because they have to pass the quiz for it to count towards their book level points and their word count. Um, and that's how we track the engagement uh, with this. Once they've taken the quiz, um, you can click on these icons in the top right hand corner with your child to have a look at their progress. So um, their progress here button, this will tell you um, what they're reading, how their reading age is improving, how many words they've read um, in total, the percentage of answers that they've been getting right on quizzes, things like that. And then the bookshelf one um, will tell them which books they've read and their quiz scores. So you'll be able to see what they've actually been doing here. And then when they finish the quiz, um, 
you could have a look at this TOPS report. This is a report that basically tells us uh, how your child is progressing towards their next certificate and if there are any gaps, any questions they got wrong, for example, um, what they did incorrectly. So that's something um, to have a look at afterwards. So really that's it for Accelerated Reader. It doesn't get much more difficult than that. Um, if there are any questions at all that arise from this that you would like to know some more information about Accelerated Reader or um, if your uh, child is struggling to engage with this and you want some ideas on how to engage them with it, um, please do not hesitate to contact your child's English teacher. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this.